YouTubers, Pipe Leisure. Doing a little yard work today. A little yard work. Cutting a little grass. There's a lawnmower. Take a little break. Smoking my uh, Missouri Mersham cob today. This is uh, it's kind of my yard pipe. I, I do all my yard work with this. And in it, we're smoking some uh, Peterson sun, Sunset Breeze. This is a nice, one of my favorite uh, aromatics. I love this stuff. I had this tin here for a couple of years. I'm kind of aging a little bit. Another hot one today. Starting to cool off a little bit though. It's only about 85. Spring's on its way. Next week it's going to be cool. About 70 degrees next week. So I was just wondering how many of you guys have these uh, these cone cob pipes um, or any other pipe like this for yard work? You know, fishing, yard work kicking around kind of pipes or if you drop them in the grass and cut them over and run them over with the lawnmower you're not gonna feel that bad I've had this one now for a couple of years actually if you look at the uh, the stem it's actually got a it's actually split it's actually broken I don't know if you can see it but actually I went on eBay today and I found uh, two replacement stems for this pipe, same color, for like two dollars. Ordered them up. I've had this cob for a couple of years now, and it, it hasn't broken yet, except for that stem. But the stem material on these on these cobs are kind of cheap. It's just a cheap plastic material. So, but everything else is fine. No major cracking on the bowl. The plastic is still holding up very well. So we'll replace the stem maybe next week. It'll, come, it'll probably should be a next week, uh, early next week. We'll replace the stem. And that should be good for uh, a couple more years. Unless I drop it in the grass and run it over the lawnmower, which I might. I might do it, I might do it today. And then I'm going to have two extra stems for uh, no pipe at all. Mm. This sunset breeze is really nice. Taking another crappy video on my phone. Oh well. I can't ride around on the, on the lawn tractor with the uh, with the MacBook Pro. I ain't dropping that on the grass. But I want you guys to leave me a comment down down in the bucket down below. How many of you guys have these uh, yard pipes? What do you, what do you have as a yard pipe? Is it an old Peterson? Is it is it a Cobb? Grabo, is it a medico or something cheap that you don't care if you lose it or break it? I use this for all my yard work mostly. Raking leaves, cutting the grass. I haven't dropped it yet. This thing's like five years uh, about four years old.
these pipes usually don't last that long. Well, this one has. Beautiful day out today. I gotta shave. I'm not even a clincher in this, uh, it's funny how this stem just cracked like that. I mean, it hasn't affected the way it smokes at all. It's fine. But I can feel it. And I put it in between my teeth. It's very spongy because of that crack. And I'm actually, since this, since this stem is a couple years old, I'm actually already biting through it. Ran the neath, you can see it. See how it's all concaved on the, on the uh, bottom half? That's because that material there is so thin. You can actually switch these stem materials out to a different, a higher, a higher grade stem. This is just a cheap one that comes with the pipe. It's fine. It's a yard pipe. I really don't give a shit. But for two dollars, a dollar a stem, I ordered it. I'll throw a new one on. Cause like I said, the the pipe itself is in still great condition. Even nicely broken in. This thing smokes beautiful. What a nice smoking pipe this is. This company's been around. It was founded uh, in 1869 by Henry Tibb. He started just making them in his garage. Kind of perfecting his craft. Got his uh, patent. He got a patent actually on the um, on the um, the coating that they put on the on the outside of the pipe. It's like a plaster. I think they actually put it on the inside too. He actually has a patent on that. And then in um, 1907, he founded uh, Missouri Mershom. Um, founded as a company and now they're producing like 2300 2300 pipes a day imagine that 2300 pipes a day it's got to be a whole shitload of these things somewhere because I don't see a lot of them around. But I'm curious what you guys think about these cobs. Zeri Mersham. I love them. Nice yard pipes. Here's the house. I'm sitting on my shed on the, uh, on the ramp. This is my smoking deck. Smoke a lot of pipes up there. This is my truck. There's my little, there's my baby. I gotta get back on that thing and cut some grass because uh, this stuff is growing by the minute. Woo, it's hot in the sun. My bird bath. Right in the sunlight here. It doesn't take good video in the sunlight. I'm gonna show you guys my fire pit. my fire pit. Had some good fires out here at night. I built this about, uh, I built it about a year and a half ago. I love it. I'm trying to get out of the sunlight. Woo! It's hot.
All right, guys. I'm gonna get back uh, cutting the grass. Just wanna check in, see what you guys think about these, uh, these cobs. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what your yard pipe is, I'm curious. All right, guys, back to work. Catch you later.